Some things I miss and some I don't. Maybe not missing is forgiving and missing is holding on. The way I can taste and smell tea berry when I miss unwrapping a pack of that gum. I miss the first day of school as a kid, a just bought outfit laid out on my made bed like an empty girl. And later as a teacher, when my stomach gurgled and I couldn't eat breakfast, a new year about to open. I miss my sisters living closer. I don't miss my brother who sends me honey bell oranges every year as if that could make up for his meanness. I miss sleeping well when I used to hear my ears let go of sound. I miss my mother baking cakes from scratch, how she'd make me take something to someone's house, especially for a weekend visit, never go empty handed. That cake on the front passenger seat of my light blue VW bug and I starving on the way down to Avalon, probably having smoked a joint, reach over, snake my hand under the saran wrap. God, that chocolate buttery icing and rich white cake that I ate by fistfuls, had to throw out the carcass and plastic plate of evidence at a gas station where I bought a case of tab to give to the bottomleys. I miss the softness of a gray v-neck sweater I had in high school. The kittens born in a box in my closet. I miss walking to school in spring when everyone's yard was wild with forsythias and lilacs. I don't miss waking up to an alarm, that sudden jolt into another world. I miss my father's voice reading to us in the back seat. The sound of earth, wind, and fire from the balcony of my dorm, the beginning of an evening blossoming. I miss knowing answers in math class, my sleeping children's heavy heads in the rearview mirror. I don't miss carrying dark secrets or stacks of papers to correct. I miss not thinking about knees and strange aches in my back when that whirl of skin and bones and muscles and blood hummed unaware. I don't miss the scariness of thinking I may never find someone to love me forever. I miss the jangle on my wrist of the gold charm bracelet that was stolen, so much taken in one afternoon, how we had to start locking the front door. I miss looking forward to the next episode of Cheers. I don't miss having to wake up early on Sundays to sit in a boring church school class, or even worse, listen to a sermon where time slowed on wooden pews and I felt trapped in stories I didn't believe. I miss believing that I had magical powers and death being so far away it could almost not be true.